It seems like every day the world is abuzz with the latest headlines about Elon Musk and Tesla. Whether it's a cryptic tweet, a newly filed patent, or a mysterious leak from inside the company, speculation is always swirling. People are glued to their screens, dissecting every word Musk says, trying to predict what Tesla's next big move will be. The company has a reputation for shaking up the auto industry, and every hint or rumor sends shockwaves through both Wall Street and Main Street. From diehard fans to skeptical analysts, everyone wants to know, what's coming next from the world's most talked about car maker? Today, June 14, 2025, the conversation is laser focused on one burning question. What will power the next generation of Teslas? The stakes have never been higher, and the possibilities seem endless. Will Tesla double down on its electric routes, or is something even more groundbreaking on the horizon? The debate raging right now is whether Tesla is about to make a radical pivot to hydrogen power, a technology Elon Musk once famously dismissed as fool cells, or if they're preparing to unveil a revolutionary new electric motor that could redefine what's possible for electric vehicles. Industry insiders are split, with some pointing to recent patents and others highlighting Musk's history of surprising the world. It's shaping up to be a classic showdown, revolutionary versus evolutionary. On one side, you have the promise of a completely new direction, hydrogen, with its potential for fast refueling and zero emissions. On the other, the relentless refinement of electric technology, pushing batteries and motors to new heights. The outcome could change the trajectory of the entire auto industry. The stakes are enormous. A breakthrough now could determine not just Tesla's future but who leads the global race for electric and possibly hydrogen vehicles for decades to come. Investors are watching closely and competitors are scrambling to keep up. So let's cut through the noise. We'll dig into the latest rumors, analyze the facts, and try to separate what's real from what's just hype. Most importantly, we'll explore what all this means for you, the driver, the investor, the curious onlooker. How will these decisions shape the cars you drive and the world you live in? Is Tesla about to make every other electric car on the road obsolete with a leap in technology? Or are they about to place a massive bet on hydrogen? changing the game entirely? The answer could reshape the automotive landscape as we know it. So grab your spanner and your curiosity, because we're about to get under the hood of the future, and what we find could change everything you thought you knew about Tesla and the next era of driving. The rumor mill is split. Will Tesla shock the world with a hydrogen-powered Model H, or double down on electric motors? Hydrogen would be a wild pivot, especially from Musk, who once called it mind-bogglingly stupid. The alternative? A next-gen electric motor, lighter, more efficient, and using fewer rare earth materials. Hydrogen is a moonshot, requiring massive investment and new infrastructure. The new motor is a direct upgrade, making Teslas better and cheaper right now. One path is high risk, high reward, the other, a strategic evolution. The industry is watching closely. Which rumor will become reality? Will Tesla leapfrog the competition, or strengthen its lead with relentless innovation? The answer could reshape the entire automotive landscape. Let's demystify hydrogen cars. They might look like any other modern vehicle on the outside, but what's happening beneath the surface is truly fascinating. Hydrogen cars represent a unique blend of cutting-edge science and practical engineering, and they're often misunderstood. So let's take a closer look at how they actually work and what sets them apart from other vehicles on the road. At their core, hydrogen cars are electric vehicles, but with a twist. Instead of relying on large, heavy batteries that need to be plugged in and charged for hours, hydrogen cars generate their own electricity as you drive. This is made possible by a remarkable device called a fuel cell stack, which sits under the bonnet where you'd expect to find a traditional engine. Here's how it works. You fill the car's tank with compressed hydrogen gas, much like you would with petrol or diesel. Inside the fuel cell, this hydrogen meets oxygen from the air. Through a chemical reaction, the fuel cell produces electricity to power the car's electric motor. The only byproduct of this process is pure water vapor, which simply exits through the tailpipe. No harmful emissions, no carbon dioxide. One of the biggest advantages of hydrogen cars is how quickly you can refuel them. Unlike battery electric vehicles which can take hours to recharge, a hydrogen car can be filled up in just 3 to 5 minutes, about the same time as a conventional car. And when you drive away, the only thing you're leaving behind is a puff of harmless water vapor. 
This combination of rapid refueling and zero tailpipe emissions makes hydrogen cars seem like the best of both worlds. You get the convenience and range of a petrol car, with the environmental benefits of an electric vehicle. It's a compelling proposition for drivers who want to go green without sacrificing practicality, but it's important to remember, hydrogen is the fuel, not water. There's a common misconception that hydrogen cars run on water, but in reality, water is just the end product of the chemical reaction inside the fuel cell. The car itself is powered by hydrogen gas which is stored safely in high-pressure tanks. To make the system even more efficient, hydrogen cars also include a small battery. This battery stores extra energy, especially from regenerative braking, just like in a regular electric vehicle. When you slow down or brake, the car captures some of that energy and saves it for later, boosting efficiency and performance. The result is a clever blend of advanced technology offering a driving experience that's both clean and powerful. You get smooth acceleration, quiet operation, and the peace of mind that comes from knowing you're not contributing to air pollution or greenhouse gases. Plus you don't have to worry about long charging times or range anxiety. Still, it's worth repeating, hydrogen cars aren't powered by water, a myth that's surprisingly common. We'll dig deeper into this misconception later but for now, just remember that the real fuel is hydrogen, and water is simply what's left over after the magic happens. Ultimately, the real magic of hydrogen cars lies in the chemistry happening under the hood, a sophisticated process that could help shape the future of clean transportation. If hydrogen cars are so great, why aren't we all driving them? The catch producing pure hydrogen is energy intensive and often polluting since most comes from fossil fuels. Clean hydrogen is possible with renewables but it's inefficient. Using lots of electricity to make fuel you'll just turn back into electricity. Infrastructure is another hurdle. Hydrogen stations are rare and expensive to build. Storing hydrogen safely requires heavy high pressure tanks, adding cost and complexity. It's a chicken and egg problem, no stations, no cars, no cars, no stations. These challenges explain Musk's skepticism, and why a Tesla Model H would be such a shock. Hydrogen's promise is real, but the obstacles are massive. For now the road to hydrogen is long and uncertain. Now let's talk about Tesla's rumored new electric motor, the more likely game changer. Reports say it's already rolling out quietly in new Teslas, lighter, more powerful, and more efficient. The secret? Advanced materials and smarter design, squeezing more power from a smaller package. Crucially, it uses fewer rare earth elements, making it greener and less vulnerable to supply chain shocks. A lighter, cheaper motor means lower costs for Tesla and potentially for you. This is classic Tesla relentless improvement, not flashy pivots. The new motor could be Tesla's next big weapon in the EV war. What does a better motor mean for you? First, it tackles range anxiety. More efficiency means more miles per charge, without a bigger battery. Imagine an extra 50 or 100 miles of range, just from smarter engineering. A lighter motor also means better acceleration, handling, and overall driving fun. Plus, using fewer rare earth metals cuts costs, making EVs more affordable. Lower prices could open the door for more people to go electric. It's not just about speed or range, it's about making EVs accessible to everyone. This is how Tesla could pull ahead, by making the best tech available to the masses. The new motor isn't just an upgrade, it's a potential industry reset. Let's bust a myth. No, you can't run your car on water. Viral posts claimed Musk unveiled a car you could fill from your garden hose. Total nonsense. Water is stable, it's not a fuel. To get energy, you'd have to split it into hydrogen and oxygen, which takes more energy than you'd get back. Hydrogen cars use hydrogen as fuel and produce water as exhaust, not the other way around. These myths spread fast, but they defied basic science. Fact checkers and engineers have debunked the water car story repeatedly. Real innovation is exciting enough, don't fall for perpetual motion fantasies. The future of cars is built on real science, not viral hoaxes. The global electric vehicle war is heating up like never before, with Tesla the long-standing leader, now facing fierce competition from international powerhouses such as BYD and NIO. These companies are not just catching up, they're pushing the boundaries of what's possible in electric mobility, each bringing their own unique strengths and innovations to the table. 
the race is no longer just about who can make the fastest or most luxurious EV, but about who can redefine the very future of transportation. Imagine a world where hydrogen-powered cars become mainstream. If a company like NIO or Toyota manages to launch a truly successful hydrogen vehicle, it would be a game-changer, opening up an entirely new market segment and forcing every other automaker to rethink their strategies overnight. Hydrogen technology promises quick refueling and long range, and if the infrastructure catches up, it could challenge the dominance of battery-powered EVs. Meanwhile, the development of next-generation electric motors is quietly revolutionizing the industry. These motors are not only more efficient and powerful, but also significantly cheaper to produce. This means automakers can deliver better performance at a lower cost, putting immense pressure on rivals who can't keep up with the pace of innovation. The companies that master this technology will have a decisive edge, potentially leaving others scrambling to catch up. As these advancements drive down production costs, we'll see electric cars become more affordable and accessible than ever before. Lower prices will not only squeeze out less efficient competitors, but also accelerate the global shift toward electric vehicles. More people will be able to make the switch, and the market will expand rapidly as a result. The real winner in this race won't just be the company with the flashiest technology, but the one that can put an electric car in every driveway. Whether it's through affordable battery-powered vehicles or a breakthrough in hydrogen fuel cells, the company that democratizes clean transport will shape the future of mobility for generations to come. Relentless innovation in battery chemistry, manufacturing, and hydrogen technology is the ammunition in this high-stakes battle. Every breakthrough, whether it's a longer-lasting battery, a faster charging system, or a more efficient fuel cell, brings us closer to a world where clean, sustainable transport is the norm, not the exception. The outcome of this technological arms race will determine not just which companies survive, but how quickly we can transition to a cleaner, greener future. The stakes are enormous, nothing less than the future of how we move, the health of our cities, and the fate of our planet. So what's the bottom line for you? The EV war means better, cheaper, and cleaner cars are coming, fast. Whether it's hydrogen, a new motor, or something else, the real winner is the consumer. If hydrogen works, five-minute refuels and zero emissions could be reality. If the new motor delivers, expect longer range and lower prices. Stay curious but be skeptical of wild claims. Real progress is built on solid engineering. The car is being reinvented and your next ride could be the most advanced yet. The road ahead, it's never looked more exciting.